Man, what's good, y'all? Hey, it's your boy Cal Boots the Truth, you know what I'm saying? What's going on? Drop this video for y'all. This one, like, like, hey, this one, this one got that heat on it, you know what I'm saying? Because it's about time I got it, you know what I'm saying? I got to talk about this. But, yeah, I'm gonna come on and get a job, you know what I'm saying? I got the condo boots on, I can't see nothing with these bars on my face. I mean, that's how you got that booty on mine, you know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about the rubbish, but anyways, you know what I'm saying? Gonna go on and crush it. But yeah, class, school is now in session. Today's topic, exes. Now, when I say exes, I mean like just, you know what I'm saying, the letter. I mean the E with the X after it. You know what I'm saying? The, the people that, that you got rid of. Now, I just want to start first and foremost by saying they exes for a reason. You dig me? Like, if they had made it in the struggle and they would have been Miss Right or Mr. Right, then they wouldn't be exes. But it's a certain mind, you know what I'm saying, that an ex can have. Now, once they get cut off, Traditionally, you know what I'm saying, they're supposed to get lost and not have nothing to do with you for the rest of their life. Like, they should just, like, go down to a rock or something. Yeah. But, in this new day and age, exes, they have, like, puppies, you know what I'm saying, they follow you around. Like, that's, that's not cool. Like, we finna have to go back and we finna have to change that. Because, there's a couple people in particular, you know what I'm saying, they, they're like crabs. Like, they hold on to you. And pull you down. I don't know everybody got some of them exes. I don't even know why. It's like, look, get on. You had the chance. You messed that up. So why are you still here? You know, it's like you have a party and then like everybody leaving and gone. You like this one person that's still in your kitchen. Like, why are you still here? Get out, man. You know what I'm saying? He in the kitchen drinking power or something or like snooping through all your chips and stuff trying to take food. But yeah, hey, exes, they need to be cut off, so like just completely severed, all the strings, everything broke. Unless it's your baby daddy or your baby mom, then you ain't really got no no option. Like you should just stick with them, cause I don't understand why people have baby moms and baby daddies and break up with them anyways. That's not healthy for y'all kids, man. Y'all need to like stick that out or something, get on Mario or something, work that out. But yeah, man, hey. People finna get flamed. Look at this video and then text or call whichever your ex is. Hit him up on Facebook or anything and tell him, hey, leave me the hell alone. I'm tired of you. Go die quickly. That way you be out of my life and I don't have to worry about you. Cause they ain't nothing but stress, you feel me? Nothing but stress. Like, they like that, you know what I'm saying? They was close at one point in time. So they might know something about you. Like me, I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't really care. Cause, I'm, I'm the type of person that's gonna make you pay with success. You know what I'm saying? You do me wrong, I'm gonna come up in the world anyways. And it's just gonna be, hey, boy did what he had to do, made out the struggle, and got on his grizzly. You feel me? Now, I'm not, Go sit here and just chop down on you the whole time. But yeah. If you feel like I'm aiming this at your throat, it, it probably means something. Then the second topic. Who calling me? Hello? What's up? You driving and calling me? See, you it ain't it ain't it ain't even that. Now you're in the middle of something because I'm making a video for Facebook. I'm making a video for Facebook, so you know what I'm saying. Making a video for all my viewers out there. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. You gonna you gonna have to. I'm gonna call you back, right? Trust. Yeah. Got everybody saying trust out here, you know what I'm saying? 
I'm, I'm like, you know, son, like, I brighten up somebody's day. But yeah, anyway, like I was saying, all these exes that go around, you know what I'm saying, trying to be trifling and do, like, I don't know, they just, like, do stuff. That's cool, because you know what? You don't get, like, this random phone call, this text message. You're like, what's that about? That's it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to have a by five minutes later. Somebody going to kick in my door. Yeah. Then you're going to get feeling mad, and that's going to be a wrap. You feel me? Like, hey, you out here doing this edge dirt. You need to get lost and beat it. All right? And another thing. Why people like, they be like, all right, somebody that you used to be with, like girlfriend, boyfriend, they can never be your little bro or your little sis. You know what I'm saying? If you ever got with them, don't. You can't, you can't, you just can't call them there. Like, that's just wrong. You can't call them bro or little sis or, you know what I'm saying? They're like, man, you know, you hooked up with the person. How are they going to be related to you now? That's just weird. I mean, it is what it is. It's pretty gross. I think it's pretty gross. But, y'all out here playing these games. Somebody gonna get that long shit, the long clips and choppers, you know what I'm saying? I don't stumble over my word and everything, I'm so heated. But yeah, somebody gonna get them long clips and choppers, man. Y'all need to be on y'all grizzly. Stop doing all this ex hating. Like, for real, because we, you know what I'm saying? It's a reason y'all in the past. Like I tell you, hey, it's two directions in life. You can get right, or you can get left. And that's just, that's just how real it is, you know what I'm saying? That's just how real it is out in the field. But in other news, life is real short. Say, the other night, me and my homeboy hit a cat. Well, it was a kid, and they had a kite on, but, I mean, it was not fault. He walked out in the street, and he got what was coming to him. I mean, I can't, I can't feel sorry for him. That's just how it is. I ain't in struggle. But yeah, to reiterate everything that's been said in this video, if you're an ex, leave your ex alone. Go away. Because if you would have wanted them, they wouldn't be your ex. You feel me? Don't like what you heard known for. I um, don't, I don't know. Maybe just like using people for a security blanket or something. Go shoot yourself in a dark room. But yeah. Don't play games with people. If you trifling, when he come back around and hit you in your face, you know what it is. And um shout out to all the other Texas campuses. Y'all be safe. Dude shooting up libraries in UT, murderers on campus at SFA. Hey, y'all be safe, you know what I'm saying? No, shout out to my boy Earl P. You know, so I thought being a savage, had to serve somebody. It just it is what it is. It don't never change, baby. We're out here in the struggle together. It don't never change. Remember that. Trust. Just trust.